Now that we've completed all the components for our MVC edition of the guessing game, it's time to test and tweak our application. Let's run through how this will work. First, when we run the guessing game on the server, the index page should load into the browser. The user will enter into a text box a guess. Because the action is do guess, the game servlet will be requested when the form is submitted. In the game servlet, we get the input data from the text boxes. We compare the guess with the target. If the guess is correct, we transfer control to correct.jsp. If it's incorrect, we're going to transfer control to guess.jsp. We also set a message and we increment the number of guesses as appropriate. In addition, we set some values to attributes on the request object, namely the message and the number of guesses. Finally, in the servlet, using a request dispatcher, we send control down to the appropriate JSP, whichever was stored in the variable URL. When the guess is incorrect, we go to guess.jsp. First thing we do in guess.jsp is collect our data either from the parameter or from request attributes. And then we display the data, or hide it as the case may be, within HTML to send back to the client. The client will keep guessing, submitting the form, going back to game servlet and guess JSP as long as it's incorrect. Finally, once they get the correct value, control will be passed to correct.jsp, and correct.jsp will retrieve the message from the attribute and then display that within the HTML back on the client. All along, our fifth component, game number, will be used when needed to represent a number in the game. So let's see if we've built this correctly. Right click on Guessing Game MVC Edition. I like to build my project manually. If not, you might also refresh. That helps it to be up to date with the latest changes. Do Run As, Run On Server. Make sure you have the appropriate server selected. It's the only thing running. Hit Finish. And in a moment, a browser should open on your machine with the index.jsp form displayed. Let's take a quick look at the target so that we know what we're working with. The target is 881. I'm going to guess 500, as is my usual guess. Hit go. The last guess was low, guess 2, which makes sense since it was 881. Let's try 900. See if this comes out high. And guess number 3. High. Guess 3. That's correct. Let's try this one for guess 4 to get it correct. If this is the case, we should start to see correct guess message and try again, play again correct number in three guesses. Was that correct? I'm not sure. I lost track of the number of guesses. Let's try again. This time the guess is 42. Guess number one, 500. Guess number two is 40. Guess number three is 42. Three guesses. Looks like everything's going correctly at this point. We'd probably test a few more times, and if we saw anything that needed changing, we'd go in and tweak it and make appropriate adjustments. This time seemed to come out okay. This has been a Piercy production.